Today's video is going to be called <laughs> Building Momentum for the Future. Now, I came up with this concept of building momentum for yourself. Now, think about this like this. When you build momentum in sports, you build momentum by scoring and being effective. You know what I'm saying? So to build momentum in AKA real life or 3D is, let's say, for example, number one, let's say you finally look in the mirror and say, I love myself 100% for who I am. And you hug yourself. You look yourself in the eyes. You accept yourself for who you really are. What you see in the mirror, I'm talking about all natural. No makeup, no mascara, none of that. No weave, no eyelashes, none of that. I'm talking about all natural. How you was born. The way you look, you are meant to look like that. And once you say you love yourself in the mirror, that's the first step to momentum. Second, now you feeling yourself, right? Now you feeling yourself. So you like, okay, fuck that. I'm not finna do the same shit I've been doing all my life. So now I'm finna go get some fruits and veggies. I'm gonna meditate. I'm gonna cleanse my body. I'm gonna detox. You know, I'm gonna start thinking positive thoughts. Cause once you eat right, you start thinking more positive thoughts. You give what I'm saying? Cause positive energy. So you did that. The second step, right? So boom, now you blazing. You're on your third step now. So let's say you start planting your feet back into earth. Now you get even more energy because you can get energy from the sun. You can get energy from planting your feet inside the earth because you get electrolytes through your feet up to your penile gland to unlock light codes in your body. You know what I'm saying? So once you start doing that, you meditating, you know what I'm saying? And you're doing things right. You start to get back on the right path. Now you're on the fourth step. Now you just hitting threes from the three point line. Like can't nobody stop you. You get what I'm saying? So the fourth step. Everybody you see, you showing respect to them. You saying hey to everybody. You being vocal. You know what I'm saying? You being social. You 13 love, man. 13 love, sister. You know what I'm saying? You you just happy. You got that good energy around you. You know what I'm saying? So fourth step, basically, I would say you got that good energy around you. Let's say you make yourself a sigil, right? Okay, once you make yourself a sigil, now you really can't be stopped because you got all this energy from copper coming towards you. You got the sun energy inside your body, you got the energy from the fruits, and you got the energy from inner earth, so now you just unstoppable, let's say you like LeBron coming down the court on a fast break, you know what I'm saying, you just hit the dunk, now you got so much momentum that they might well just put you on the bench, you feel me, like, building momentum for the future is like, basically this concept I thought of is like, doing things right now, that will affect your future. Just like basketball. Let's say you be like, okay, I'm open for this three. If I hit this three, I'm going to build some momentum. So in the future, if I get open again, I'm going to hit another three. Think about it like that. You get what I'm saying? So build momentum for yourself. Like actually want to take steps to be a better person. See, it's hard to take steps because the first step of getting better is to admit that you have a problem. And it could be any problem. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people say they love their sales, but the ones who say they love their sales right away, I ain't saying that's a bad thing, but the ones who say, yeah, I love myself, those be the ones that's in disguise because if you really loved yourself, you wouldn't be trying to dress up just to go out for an hour. You know what I'm saying? You wouldn't go dress up just because you finna be around a certain person. You come as is in this physical form. You know what I'm saying? It's some people that don't even got clothes on their back. And people always say, oh, man, I hate when people use that type of stuff. Oh, it's people that don't got no food. Well, idiot, it really is people that don't got no food. Just because you don't see them don't mean they don't exist. You know what I'm saying? Somebody might not see you. Okay, they don't see you, so you don't exist to them. But that don't mean you don't exist. You get what I'm saying? So you got to just build momentum for your life. Do things right now to help you in the future. You know what I'm saying? Because we are present beings. We live in the now. So let's say, for example... Something happened to you yesterday. Now, you you just focused on yesterday, but it's a new day. If it's a new day, fuck what happened yesterday. You get what I'm saying? See, once you go to sleep and you rise again, that's basically like death and rebirth because when you go to sleep, you're going to the spiritual world or the astral world. So basically, like, you being free. So then when you come back to your body and you wake up, you just rose again. You get what I'm saying? Like, real talk. This is real shit. Like, build momentum for yourself, people. Like... The only way your the the only way your momentum can be stopped is if somebody block you coming down the court for that fast break. I'm just giving you signs and symbols just to help you out. You get what I'm saying? You gotta love yourself, people. I'm not saying love yourself just because for my health. You know what I'm saying? I'm actually saying love yourself because it's a very strong energy behind the word love. Words of the day for today is build momentum when you coming down for that fast break. 
for that dunk, you feel me? And basically what that means for the slow mos, if you have an epiphany and you start to realize something about your life, follow your first mind and actually go with those instincts, you know what I'm saying? And take them right steps to do something better with your life. Because at any moment, we can be taken. And not in a bad way, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people are transitioning out. This is real talk.